Hi, I'm James Thompson, the Chief Executive of Santa Estates. We started looking at the dairy back in 2008 and it took you know, a good three or four years of research in order to, to, to really identify A, what it would be and, and how it would work within the overall business. And therefore we came up with a New Zealand style system. Uh, and it's a very simple system that we've employed. And, you know, we can grow a lot of grass here. You know, that's one of our competitive advantages. So why do I want to house cows when I can walk cows to, to something that's very cheap to, to grow and to feed? And I felt that with a grass-based system where we were turning as much grazed grass into milk as possible was the only long-term sustainable way at scale to do it because of the capital required to do an intensive system. Hi, I'm Chris Williams. I'm the farm manager here at Santa Estates. In regards to the system itself, it's an enjoyable system. It's a, it's a very nice way to farm because effectively you, you're just looking after one cow, so they all calve at the same time, we get them all back in calf at the same time, we dry them all off at the same time. So even though it's extremely busy, it's only for short periods of time. So that means you can, you can focus all your attention and try to do the best job you can. But also it's a nicer way for the cows, it's, a, it's not as intense. You know, we're just we're allowing the cows to behave naturally, or that's how we try to farm. We try to just allow them to do their natural thing and they are naturally designed to eat grass. The point for us is that this grass is the most valuable source for us. This is how we try to make our money. You know, if we can turn grass into milk, that's the most cheapest and efficient way to do it. So each of these girls will eat 16 kilos of dry matter a day, so that's what we feed them. They do have a good life and yes it's challenging in the winter but in the summer you know they are out grazing grass um, you know, getting very well fed and, and, and producing lots of milk. You know we've carved a thousand cows in 27 days so uh, the work does get to you at times but uh, it only takes a day like today when the weather's great the cows are outside looking happy to just uh, give you a bit of a rejuvenation and, and kick you on again.